update now. <laughs> All right. Okay, as y'all know, this is gonna take a while, so. <laughs> it's just barely moving. Okay, real quick, while we're waiting. <laughs> I know this is kinda weird, but um, I forgot to mention this in my first take, so I'm just adding it to, to this video. I was having some issues starting the game when I press on the icon or the app it wouldn't open um, so at one time I just you know shut down my device and started it up again but it st didn't do anything it still wouldn't open so what I did and it, this happened for both of my uh, devices so I'm I'm assuming <laughs> it's gonna happen to you at some point so but what I did was I um, deleted the app and reinstalled it. So make sure you're you're tied into Game Center for iOS or um, Google Play, I think it's called, or or Android. I mean, uh, not Android, um, uh, but whatever whatever you use to download, wherever you download your games from. Make sure you have a this connect. There's a connection, so all of your information is saved. Um, and then what you want to do is, you know, you want to delete the app and then you want to reinstall it. So when you do reinstall it, word to the wise, <laughs> this, this is the second thing, your heroes are unlocked, at least mine were. So I had to go back and lock my heroes. Of course, if, you, if you're not locking your heroes, then this doesn't apply, you don't have to worry about it. But if you are locking your heroes, your hero is going to be unlocked, so you got to go back and lock them. That's one thing. Now, the, But the good thing about it, not only does your game start to get up again, but when your heroes are unlocked, there might be some heroes that you have back here in the back that you don't want. You know, they're, they're duplicates. And um, instead of saving them to your, <clears throat> your warehouse... When you hire a hero, you click this up on top, but you can you can save them in your your warehouse, which is better to me because in your warehouse you can use them. Um, if you if you put them in your hero altar, you can't use them except to upgrade um, your heroes, but it only to a certain point. If if you if you level level them up. <laughs> too much you can no longer use them so this is this is a good way of using these heroes you can uh, when they're, when they're unlocked when you go through this procedure uh, deleting your app and reinstalling it now you have access to these other heroes that you're trying to get rid of and I already did it so all of these heroes I want to keep um, but if you want to get rid of some this is a good way of doing it you just reinstall the the, the your app go into um, the hero altar and then whatever hero you want to keep obviously you can just go into heroes and they'll be all lined up like I said I already did it so you don't see anything um, and you can delete them you can eat you know have whatever hero you want eat them up and they'll be gone <laughs> so that's a little cute little trick, I think, because, you know, your hero altar could get full, full up, too. Especially if you don't want um, 
you know, the heroes just to be, you know, sit, sitting in there and they're not doing anything. That's just a quick little tip. Just make sure, you, like I said, you're connected to Game Center or Google Play or, or um, Amazon something. I don't know. Just whatever, wherever you get your games from. Make sure you have your um, your account secure. So when you do delete the app, you still have the information so you can reinstall the app and all your information and your account and everything is still there. That's just a quick tip. <laughs> okay, we're ready to rock, I guess. Huh? Okay, see. Can we go right to it? Yeah. Oh, good. <laughs> I'm about to say, I hope the sound comes on. All right, courtesy car. Okay, oh, yeah, as you guys know, this is my main account. We already did this to my second account. Nothing, nothing exciting happened. <laughs> uh... So here we are on our courtesy raid three times one out of three. That that was from before we already started it. So got this one. Build a pack. Nothing there. Fountain. Nothing there. Nothing there. Over here, lucky plant for prizes. Cashier's day. Sunken treasure. Nothing. Nothing. Sign in. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, okay. Got something kind of new. I don't know what that is. Your strategy update details. So we get our 100 gems. We got Caddy Spirit and Searing Slayer. New talent, aggressive price, and Insignia Blood Barrier. Hero skins for the heroes. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, you can now watch ads to complete quest quickly. Perfect trial. Ten new stage ads. Hey, sta two new stages added. <laughs> All right, and some adjustments. I don't look at ads. <laughs> I don't. I mean, I don't. It's a, you know they have ads where you can get gems and all this other stuff. But I don't. I don't do a lot of stuff. Because this is the thing, I don't know, when you click on something, you don't know what's going on. There's always this exchange of information, and you don't know what they're taking from your device or from you. So, I would rather not uh, look at anybody's ad or go any farther than where I'm going to now. Because the next thing you know, you're getting... Um, um, emails or messages or something on your phone and you're like where does this come from <laughs> so i don't even bother with that stuff okay so let's see what are we gonna do first oh there's another well i wouldn't say there's a number of things but clear from the friends in fact i should have Gaming art, I believe it's gaming art. Gaming, gaming art. See, I don't have permission. I like to, I do like to share things, and maybe he's okay with this. <laughs> um, maybe I post it, maybe not. But he did come up with his own version of what he thought was the best heroes. He he ranked them from excellent, you know, top hero, excellent hero, the best hero you can get, on down to. You know, the ones that are waste, might waste your time. <laughs> okay. So. Claim. What? Oh. Okay. Oh, claim. I gotta do all this stuff. Okay. <clears throat> so, you might see his actual list or you might not. Um, but you can go to his page, obviously. Here's a YouTube channel. And you can check... Um, his video on what he felt was you know the best heroes the best epic heroes 
and I kind of follow his advice. Um, I have, you know, the heroes that I do have that he suggested that were, um, you know, very well, <laughs> decent um, he heroes that you might want to invest in. So I said, okay, well, I have these heroes. I might as well use them. Let's see how well they do. And, uh, you know, they leveled up somewhat. I knew about, let's see, what could we do? Let's go do this let's, one thing at a time. Let's do this. That one. Start that one. And then do another one. This one. And then put that one, this one over here. Select it. And let's see, what else right quick? Um, let me just do, get our rewards, I guess. We got some defense. So, one day, a day ago, it didn't do anything. Okay, so we got our update rewards. What else? Blowing we'll, we'll out and catch a side in the event. Okay. Um, so, I guess we can go to our... Oh, that was what? Oh, this one. Okay, that's cool. Um, so, let's see. Um, we can go to our current... And uh, we have, he said, he suggested that cold hair, mummy, these mummy, cold hair, um, our big guy that we don't have currently, I think he's on my second account. Let me see right quick. Um, where's the warehouse? I think he's on my second account. Just picked him up. Yeah, he's on my second account. The big guy. <laughs> the, uh, I can't think of his name. Let me see. Where Where is he? He has... Oh, here. Um, Colossus, right. Colossus. In fact, I can look at it here. Um, it's Colossus, Royal Mommy, Cold Hair. And our Wave Lady. Uh, Water Priestess. He feels that you are your... your your second best top heroes. Of course, the, your best top hero is Dynamica. But he suggested these other ones, uh, Water Priestess, uh, Cold Hair, Royal Mummy, and Colossus was right below that. And then he picked, I think he picked, uh, uh, Axe Punisher was one of them. And then, uh, I can't, I can't think. <laughs> um, bar Barbarian Rider, um, uh, Lady World Core, I think, and then Exquisiteness would be right below them. And then I think, like, uh, uh, Vermilica, I think it was Vermilica, I don't know after that. I, I, I hope, yeah, I, I'll probably, I hope he doesn't mind if I, if I show the list then you know you can you can actually see his list if not like i said you can go to his his um youtube channel and check it out for yourself and i tend to agree with them since i've uh, changed things up uh, i have these heroes on my uh, uh i'm using them right now <laughs> well i'm using uh royal mommy and cold hair those are the ones that that I have that uh, I'm using, well, along with the Baron Rider, Rambar, Axe, and Axe Punisher, and Navanica. Okay, and uh, also as you see in my the warehouse, we do have a Water Priestess. So during my event. <laughs> Gym rolling event that'll happen in a few months. I mean, a few months, a few weeks. End of the week, end of the month. <laughs> Getting out everything mixed up. Um, we'll open up Water Priestess and uh, level up her up a little bit. But I want to see, obviously, I want to see what what happens during our event, our gym roll. See if we're lucky enough to get any heroes, and then you know if we are getting get some. If we are lucky enough to get good some good heroes, we'll start leveling them up too. But it depends on, you know, how, uh, if the, 
hero is worth it or not. <laughs> so we'll see. But I'm going to say, right now I'm just trying to save everything, save all my resources, and waiting until the general session before I decide on how I'm going to spend everything and who I'm going to level up and all this other good stuff. But we do have Water Priestess. We got her on a free roll. On uh, my uh, second account, I think we got uh, a Colossus. And uh, did we get somebody else? I think we had a Colossus. I know we had a Colossus, but I, I'm not sure if we got anybody else. I think we got a Colossus. I think, I think there was two, but I'll have to look at it and um, report back to you guys. Or, But you'll see, when we do the um, gym roll, I'm going to do both accounts. So we'll go over everything and the whole nine yards. So... Uh, we do have Water Priestess on this account, along with the other two. Um, Royal Mummy and, uh, the kid. Um, <laughs> uh, what is he? Let me see. What is he? Royal Mummy and Code Hair. Okay. So, I, when Code Hair came out, there was word about him being pretty good. I, I already know that. And, uh, I think, um, Judicious Fire did mention also... Uh, well, he did, you know, he did, he mentioned Max Punisher, but he also, and he mentioned, uh, Barbarian Rider, but he also mentioned, uh, Royal Mummy as well. You know, in certain game modes, um, this is what we're talking about, really, but I think overall, uh, all of these heroes have something to bring to the table. You just have to, you know, take the time to level them up. Excuse me. Um, okay, so let's... Before we get too far ahead of ourselves, let's go ahead, go back, and look at our. We had to do the. Oh, let's do this right quick. Uh, this one. This one. And this one. Okay, I think we got a new. What do we got? Yeah, a new member. Okay. I'm using something, something. <laughs> okay, a uh, new friend. Okay, um, so let's go ahead and look at our new, what's this one? Oh, this is a guild. Yeah, that's right, it's a guild event. Yeah, we don't have enough. Oh, we do have one gem. Uh, let me see. Rebate. What was it? Rebate? Oh, no. Accumulation. Oh, gem pack. That's what it was. You get one gem. Get some goodies. So don't forget, uh-oh, did it happen? Okay. So we can add that to the list. Update gifts. So we can add all the gems is what's important. <laughs> we need those gems. Okay, so uh, let's go to check out these newbies. We have... Okay, like I said, Caddy Spirit and Soaring Slayer. And they're both rollable. Gem rollables. Okay, hi. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. Um, this one deals 180. Oh, let's go up. It's a 10. Deals uh, 18,000. 1,800. <laughs> um, attack damage to every nearby enemy target. Ignores damage limits of targets. Cool down 6 seconds. This hero is immune to stun. Reduces damage received by 70%. When this hero performs a basic attack, it has a 70% chance to increase all nearby enemy heroes damage received by 10%. So it's all about nearby heroes. This effect cannot be removed. It can stack until the hero uses its skill again. Count down one second. So that's pretty decent. Uh, good, as you can see, good, decent attack damage. And, and, and nearby, talk about nearby enemy here. So I don't know how many squares are out, but obviously it's a, we're talking about attacking uh, <coughs> The more enemies that are grouped together, the better. This is what she looks like pretty. I think it looks nice. And uh, between the two heroes, I think this is probably the better one. 
better one out of the two. Okay, so that's hers. Then we go to the new one. The other new one. Blistering strike. Searing slayer with blistering strike. That's what he looks like. Just the opposite. <laughs> he starts out with the pretty purple pastels and then he goes to gold and white. Okay, so he deals 2,000 attack damage to the nearest enemy target. So that sounds like the nearest one enemy target nearby. So these, these aren't uh, global attackers. These it's all about near tar near enemy targets that are close to them. And then this one is even more restrained. Um, it's just one enemy target <laughs> that's near. Them. So for the next four seconds, every base attack from this hero deals an additional a hundred thousand fixed damage to and removes thirty energy from the target. Cool down five seconds. This hero is immune to disarm and reduces damage received by 70%. When his basic attack targets an enemy hero, he makes the target for 10 seconds. Shearing Slayer. What? When his when his basic attack targets an enemy hero, he marks the target for 10 seconds. Okay. Shearing Slayer gains 30% more attack speed. For 10 seconds when he performs a basic attack against the marked target against the marked target this effect can stack and cannot be removed so it's all about that one target hopefully it's a <laughs> it's probably the best hero on the other team that would be a help but you know again that depends on where you drop them at you want to drop them obviously you want to drop them on the targeted here a targeted hero because that's what it that's basically what his skill says so you know i mean i can say you have to know what your hero what can do and that's how you use them in the different game modes like some game mode obviously you're dealing with heroes in a start in a small area you know usually close together like say i don't know um Uh, what's it called? Oh, come on. Sheesh. Lost Realm. Well, when you attack, well, when you attack, you're attacking targets. Oh, wow, what's that? <laughs> uh oh. You're attacking targets in a closer area, confined area. So, depending on your hero. Obviously, it's gonna make a difference. Boom. This one's like that, and okay, collect. And uh, let me see. There's another one. Is it this one? No, it's not this one. Oh, Lost Battlefield is another one. Rank. Okay, we got. Oh, we got 20 more gems. All right. So this is another one. Oh wow! Didn't we? Oh, okay. Damn it. Oh, what? What's going on? Oh, that's Arena. Sorry. Um, Lost Battlefield. <clears throat> so, if you target these guys, this one's the same thing, but it's obviously set up a little bit different. Uh, which way do I do? What do I do? I do the second best one. Or do I do the first crappy one? I forgot. I do it like that. Okay. Challenge. It's in the same thing. It's, a, it's in a small group. So these heroes that are limited as far as uh, area, this is where you want, this is where these heroes should shine because the enemy targets are just right, you know, either nearby or right in front. So that's there's a two examples. I think there's a more, but there's a main two examples where the enemy is, like I said, either in front of your hero and, or um, in, a, in a close proximity of your hero. Okay, so uh, so we read the description. Let's go to let me see. Let's go to. 
of Exenia. Let's, let's move this out the way. This one, uh, see here, Talents and Insignia. Here we go. All right, Blood Barrier. Level one. Let's see how far we can go. Ten. Okay, it reduces damage received by seventy-five percent. No countdown. No cooldown. I mean, yeah, no cooldown. We do, so it's a healing um, talent. When attacked, has a seventy percent chance to be immune to three condition instances for the next three seconds. Cool down three seconds. Okay. So that's a healer one, and then the next one, <clears throat> aggressor's price. Increase attack by two twenty six. To 60 <laughs> percent but reduces the tax me by 50 so there's a little bit of uh you know want to be concerned about that gotta take a look at that if you have especially if you have a hero that already has a slow attack speed it just means it's gonna be even slower but if it has a good if it's a good attacker then that's this might be helpful but helpful but uh obviously if this attack speed is too slow then the damp the increased attack is not gonna um, be too much of a factor so you're gonna have to make sure you have a hero that has some extra buff and speed like maybe a pad or something like that or another ex uh or well i mean you can only use it well you can use two maybe three so it just depends on what other or or um uh, not insignias, uh, what are they called? Enchantments, okay, or traits, things like that. You know, other, other, um, access, ax, ax, <laughs> um, um, other accessories, I guess, I don't know, but other attributes, let's put this one, other attributes that you can use uh, you can add to your hero to all obviously increase certain aspects So these are the things that you have to pay attention to But first you have to know what your hero can do to begin with And then know what the other attributes are and how these attributes can help obviously your hero and in this case, more likely it's their epic hero. But of course, you can it can help the other heroes too because you can use your other heroes in in um, in, in addition to uh, your epic heroes. So your epic heroes obviously are built around uh, your other your your um, legendary heroes. So you want to have good legendary heroes with good um, attributes as well. Because everything stacks up. Everything helps your epic, in this case, your epic hero. This is the attribute boost. So it gives you the attribute boost. Excuse me. That your other, that your other heroes are tied to this hero will give you. Okay. But I'm, you know, I'm sure if you're a seasoned player, you already know all of this already. Um, so we went over the traits. We went over the heroes. So that's probably basically it. We wanted to see if we got lucky. Did we have? I didn't even see, did we have? Our free hero? <laughs> I didn't remember if we did it or not. High hero, okay. Never mind. This one wants to, to spin, so I guess I was gonna wait and to see. I, I maybe we did it already. This is new. They did. They refigured the the quest uh, screen, so they have everything like they had before. It, it's in a different, you know, it's a design, but it's it's a lot easier to see everything there and then then click on something and then pro proceed than the way that they had it before because it was so confusing. Um. But this way, oh, see now, twenty-five health. <laughs> so we're not we're not getting any freebies this time. We only got the um, the one gem spending, and we got the rewards. And of course, we got the rewards for uh, signing in and 
uh, during the update. So that's it, really. We'll just have to wait until our general session at the end of the month. I, went, I can't say a specific day because it, we're looking to find out what other uh, rewards will be available like Hero Collector as an example. Something that will reward us for the gems that we spend. So if we have, if we can do it on a day that these other um, uh, modes are available to us, that's the day we'll do it. So we're waiting for that day. <laughs> right now we got 34,000 gems and I think we have 24,000 on my second account. And then obviously we have a good pile of gems. Uh, 494, 450, 80 for 5, and 906 for 10. Okay, but we're not going to use, obviously we won't use all of them. And let me see, I think we have also, on my other, on my other account, we also, we have a chance to get, I didn't, well I didn't mention, I guess I mentioned that, it's alright, but we'll mention it then too. But we have a chance to get Axe Punisher. And on this account, let me see who else is here. Let's see if we can get a, let me see who we can get. Get, oh, okay, Ice Lady. <laughs> okay, and this one is what, Insidia? Okay, and we can get this one. Uh-oh. Oh, we don't have it on this one. I thought we had it on this one. I had it on both of them. What did I do? Oh, that's right. Well, yeah, I didn't. Ha you don't have to get the same thing, but we have the shards uh, where you can get 20 shards of a epic hero. And we're on my second account. We're set up to get Ice Punisher, so we're gonna grab Ice Punisher. Yeah, we don't have it on here. So we're going to have to, hopefully between now and then, our general session, maybe we can get that. And uh, we can grab a um, another epic hero. We don't have it here. We just have uh, epic hero vested so select box one, breakthrough select box one, and super pet crystal select box. That's all we got. Okay. All right. What you can do. Let me see. So we're close to getting. If we do get that box, we're close to getting. Uh, maybe nobody. Uh, another Axe Punisher and a Mad Inventor. Usually it's just that between the two of those. Axe <laughs> Punisher and Mad Inventor. Um, 81 for Demon Stalker. All right. We only got 12 Dynamica. Okay. So yeah. So, we'll, even if we don't get a good hero, we'll at least we'll know we're going to get an Axe Punisher for my second account. Okay, so that's it for me. So, we'll see what happens. If anything happens between now and our general, I'll sure record it and I'll share it with you guys. If not, we'll see you at the end of the month <laughs> for our general. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Take care. And we'll see you next time.